Well, Bemidji State University celebrated Martin Luther King Jr. Day today with a concert featuring his favorite songs. Lakeland News reporter Sherelle Moore has a look at the tribute for this week's Community Spotlight. For Bemidji State University, Martin Luther King Jr. Day means more than a break from school. It's a time to honor a great man and reflect on his message. He was a person who was an advocate for education and loved working with young people. Dean of Students, Dr. Jesse Grant, led this year's program. He says Dr. King has had a significant influence on his life. Knowing Dr. King as I did and having studied him and having um, had a number of experiences in, in my life around those particular areas as a person who grew up um, with parents who um, march with King and, and, and tell those stories with such delight and joy. During the program, there are performances from the BSU Choir, a jazz band, and a few emotional speeches given by facilitators from the Bemidji Boys and Girls Club. That are incredible and are able to do extraordinary things. I knew a few things. One, Dr. Martin Luther King loved music. Two, his favorite song was Precious Lord. Three, a mantra of his life was, if I could help somebody. So those were the songs that we sung, to, that we sung today in our program. Bemidji State University wanted to make sure that Dr. King's message was heard, which is to spread love. Today, they celebrated with a day of service. Our students will be at four sites in the community, our food, you know, our food bank, they'll be here on campus working with United Way, you know, doing bag buddies, and then they'll also be at the Boys and Girls Club doing on various service projects there. And so the important piece is to look at the life that you're living, the work that you're doing, and being able to be of service to someone. A documentary was shown about Dr. King on Friday, so students can understand where he came from. Dr. Grant says he hopes the entire city of Bemidji will spread the civil rights leader's message today. It's, it's an opportunity for you to sit back and reflect in those particular pieces. And so it's not a situation of this person has, this person doesn't have, but it's how is it that we as a community can look at improving what's here in Bemidji, Minnesota, making sure that people feel welcome, people feel embraced, people feel supported. Reporting in Bemidji with this week's Community Spotlight, Sherelle Moore, Lakeland News. And nearly 50 BSU students participated in the day of service today. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.